All right. Um, Nigel Farage made an announcement, and um, it was very well crafted and very political. Nigel Farage believes that this country can be salvaged, reformed, hence the name of his party, uh, by trying to walk a, a fine line between um, being promoting British values, promoting the, the British patriots, but also throwing away a whole group of people that um, that follow Tommy Robinson and so many of the people that voted for you, Nigel, support Tommy Robinson. So your speech um, gets you nowhere. Um, I, I reckon you think that you believe you can come in in four years' time, win the next general election and reform this country. There won't be much of a country left, mate. OK? The acceleration has started. I was I was wrong when I said in previous videos I wasn't convinced the acceleration would start because of um, Tony Blair sort of pulling the strings, but boy, was I wrong. OK? The acceleration has started and it's necessary. Don't do violence. But it was inevitable that this would happen. Um, uh, my my advice to people would be uh, peacefully protest, but just don't do the violence. And if you see people doing the violence, se separate yourself from them. Uh, but yeah, anyway, so the acceleration is happening. Um, people on a mass are waking up. Labour have completely screwed any chance of winning re-election, and I don't think they can hold on to this government. This parliament has uh, is built on very shaky foundations. The, the Labour Party is divided into three main groups and they don't like each other, they're just sort of getting along for the time being. Um, Kia, you, um, if you bow down to one group, it ain't going to go well for you because they don't respect you, they don't like you, and as soon as they take power, you're, you're for it. Figuratively, not literally. But anyway, yeah, so Nigel, you can't play this, you can't... Um, you can't just throw Tommy under the bus constantly because the people that support him voted for you. And at some stage, my advice to you would be to word things in a similar way to this. You don't like Tommy. You think he's a bit of a thug. But you also understand that the things he's saying are true. And two things can be true at the same time. Um, you're, you're going to... Uh, if you're going to assume that the majority of people that vote for you don't also like Tommy, then you, you're, you're mad, you know, because then when you come to this next election, I'm afraid another party will come up that is overtly pro-Tommy, and you want to get that red wall that Labour have lost? I don't think you'll get it, mate. So, you know, if you've got any sense at all, you will try very diplomatically to not align yourself, but to stop attacking the man and uh, and go from there. But anyway, what do I know? You know, I'm just a cook. Anyway, see you soon. Bye.